All right, good morning everybody from the reunion convention. Look at the merch store. It's an inflatable Dunder Mifflin and the crowd is back there. It is massive. It's getting ready to start up. So let's go take a look around before things explode and uh, have a fun day at the reunion. This is Dwight's actual car from the show. How cool is that? And of course we've got a hay maze behind it, but <laughs> that is so, so cool. Okay, so it's still VIP time, and this is the line for Rain Wilson. It literally wraps like around the convention center. Today is gonna be insane. All right, only at the office reunion can you meet the fan designer of the Lego set. How are Hi. you? Hi, nice to meet you. What's your name? I'm Jonathan. Jonathan, JJ, nice to meet you. I can't you. shake your hand because yeah, I'm holding the camera. Yeah, I will just pat you on the shoulder. We'll take Hi. one of those. What's it been like today, getting to meet people and talk about the set? How's it been so far? Uh, it's been really weird. I've been, uh, it's surreal, like uh, I, I I have a quasi fame which scares me. Um, I've had a lot of people come up to me. I have to carry a Sharpie with me now. Um, it's cool, it's really a lot of fun. Uh, meeting the cast is so surreal too. Uh, but I hope everyone enjoys the set and like has fun and I hope that you have fun here too. I'm gonna have him sign my set, let's go. Right, so I've been collecting all the autographs, doing pretty good so far, but still got several to go, and there's Rain Wilson over my shoulder. How cool is that? So these are actual costumes that were worn on the show. How awesome is that? Okay, JJ's about to show me the designer box. There's something different about it, so walk me through it. Uh, the designer copy is a little bit different in terms of the box art because uh, in the US you get boxes that are printed out here, but this one came from Denmark. It's one of the 10 designer copies, and as you can see, compared to your set, it's actually set up differently. Bases for home. I've got one autograph left to go and then I'll have gotten everybody that I wanted from here, which is super exciting. But uh, yeah, man, the reunion con has been so much fun. I've had such a blast. And if you're an Office fan, you absolutely need to figure out a way to get here in the future because it's just been so much fun. Everybody here has been so cool. All the guests have been great. And just talking to people about a show I love has made it worth all the while. And of course, getting the set signed was an added bonus. So gonna wrap it up here and catch up with you guys in a bit. They've got an inflatable bar here that's like a replica of poor Richards. <laughs> that is so awesome. Well, with that, the reunion con is over for me. That is because I'm only attending today on Saturday. Um, it is open Sunday as well, but I got everything done today that I needed to. So I'm going to call it a day here. That being said, it was a lot of fun. If you are an office super fan, you have to make it a point to get to one of these shows someday because it is literally Dunder Mifflin to the max. It is so much fun. And of course, all the guests were super cool too. Now I was super grateful to attend as an influencer. So as we saw, Kelly is on my badge, which is really funny and of course you've got the scan on the back to see everything but uh let's go ahead and talk about the autograph process now 
the big thing about this show, to me, the impression I got is that this is mostly an autograph convention. Now, as we saw, there are dealers and things like that there, and there's tons of cool office swag to pick up, but most people spent their day waiting in line to meet their favorite office celebrities, and, you know, that's basically what I did, too. Now, the big concerns that this con faced this year were Oscar Nunez canceled at the last minute due to getting sick. Obviously, you know, we want people to be as healthy as possible, but that definitely was disappointing for a lot of fans. But, you know, again, health comes first. And then Rain Wilson's line was insane. So he literally had over a thousand people in line at any time all day. It would not shock me if he signed 5,000 autographs today, and that could even be on the low side. Um, I did hear at the end that people got turned away literally after waiting six hours in line because he had to go or the con was shutting down or whatever. So, you know, that definitely is not a great thing if you came here and all you did was wait in line all day to meet Rain Wilson. You know, that's tough. I got in line basically as soon as I got there, and even I waited two hours, which was kind of nuts. But let's go ahead and talk about getting the autograph. So, of course, I got Brian Baumgartner to sign near Kevin, because I figured, like, keeping everybody signing in the black area, that's the closest I could get to Kevin right there. We've got uh, Paul Lieberstein, who, of course, was Toby, so I got as close as I could to him there. Leslie David Baker signed near Stanley. Kate Flannery signed near Meredith. Creed Bratton, well, he's just Creed Bratton, so he signed right there. And Rain Wilson signed here, which was as close as we could get to Dwight. And then for some extra autographs, I, I got an autograph from JJ, who was the Lego fan designer for this set. It was his Lego idea set that was submitted. And I got David Cockner, who played Todd Packer, and he wrote his character name on there, which is super cool. And finally, unfortunately, the autograph did not come out super great, but I did get Andy Buckley's autograph as well, who played David Wallace on the show. And uh, yeah, that was really cool. I just wish it was in a different shade. Even though I asked for red, unfortunately, it just really didn't show up too great. But that was really cool. And then I got to meet the entire cast, too. Now, I did pay a fortune for the photo op to meet all of them, but everybody was super cool. It was a very quick photo op experience, and I gave them all my mini superheroes today brick and their respective minifigure to hold, and my plan was to get those figures back, but the way the line moved, they ended up keeping them all. So now I'm going to need to track down those office figures again. It's like, oh, come on, man. But I do still have Oscar because I didn't give Oscar it since he wasn't here. The VIPs got this cool reunion. Union backpack and it was filled with goodies and I got one as an influencer but there was a reunion con pin in there uh, a fun card game for ASAP as possible like straight out of the show then we got a bunch of like random Chicago based stuff uh, we got these rocket books which are like digital um, notebooks kind of interested to check those out and then we also got Rain Wilson's new book so Definitely a lot of cool swag in the backpack. And with that being said, that's going to bring the video to a close. So if you have any questions about the Reunion Con that I can answer in the comments, definitely let me know. I'd be happy to help you plan out your next experience if you're going to come to this in the future. If you were there, let me know how it was for you. I did get to meet several of you today, which was pretty awesome. And uh, yeah, that's going to be it for this video. Thanks again to the Reunion Con for having me. Thanks to all the great guests here for being so awesome. And until next time, build on liked what you saw and you liked what you heard, feel free to click that subscribe button for more LEGO videos coming in the near future.